Hello guys, welcome to the next video on JavaFX tutorial for beginners. In the last two videos, we have been seeing how we can create a media player using JavaFX. And we have written a code to load our media file, resize it, and to add some functionality like play pause or play faster or play slower or move the video to the start or to the last. Now in this video, we will try to add a volume bar to your media player so we can control the volume of our media player. So let's get started. So first of all, what I'm going to do is I'm going to open my main.fxml file in scene builder. And in this scene builder, what I'm going to do is I'm going to search for a slider, which is a horizontal slider, and I'm going to drag and drop in my bottom, uh, you know, horizontal box or H box, which I have here. Okay, so just uh, drag and drop this slider here. And then you have uh, some functionality of your slider, for example, minimum value, maximum value, which is okay for us, zero and 100. And we can set the initial value also from here. But we are going to uh, set the initial value or value to the slider using the code, not from here which will be uh, better for us and then we will just give the id to our slider we can say it's our volume slider okay and just uh, copy the name save your uh, fxml file go to your project refresh your uh, project and go to the main controller.java class and in here first of all we are going to add this slider so just write at the rate fxml and then slider search for the slider and the name of the slider is volume slider as we have given in the fxml file right now using this uh, volume slider what we can do is first of all we will go to our initialize method which is like a uh, first method which will be called when uh, this app will run or this class will run and what we are going to do is first of all uh, take the slider and then dot set value so just call set value and uh, then we will uh, call our media player instance here and then we will call a method called get volume okay so just write get volume and this volume if you hover over on this method you can see the default value of uh, this uh, get value method is one and one means here is maximum value and zero means the minimum value okay and you can see in the slider if you observed in the properties our maximum value for the slider was 100 right so it's 100 times more so what we can do here is we can multiply this get value by 100 which will be you know proportional to our volume property okay and now in the next step what we are going to do is we will take a volume slider once again and then call a property called value change property or value property and then call a method called add listener and in the constructor of this uh, add listener we will just write new invalidation listener okay so just search for new invalidation listener and you can see it has uh, given us this default method using this invalidation listener right and inside this invalidated method what we want to do is we want to set the value according to the value set on the volume slider right so just take your uh, mp or media player object and then just call a method called set volume and this set volume takes a double value right which can be taken from the value of the slider so just take the volume slider dot get value and this will give you the value in proportional to 100 right so to convert this value uh, to match with your media player value you need to divide it by 100 
right? In here, we have multiplied it, and in here, we need to divide it, okay? And then save your project and build your project, and then run your project. So run it, and now our uh, app is running. So let's play our app. Hello, guys, in this video, I'm and going to pause the app, on... and you can see the slider is on. 100 right so the default value which was given by this get volume method is 1 which is multiplied by 100 and this value is set to your uh, volume slider right once again i'm going to play my video and then i'm going to uh, move this slider and see what happens with the volume so you can see the volume has been reduced to the minimum value of the slider which is zero right and you know as you increase this uh, volume slider By the volume will Java also increase to your uh, Java project or other is to add a Java FX so in this way you can add a volume slider to your media player I hope you've enjoyed this video please write comment and subscribe and bye for